ladies and gentlemen, Mrs. Jenny Rowland singing our national anthem. Please rise for the singing of the national anthem, if you can. <laughs> Thank you. 
Join us by displaying and waving the American flag as our token of pride and support for the USA. Children of all ages enjoy Evans Pass Recreational Adventures of All Seasons. Also, number 11 here on the nice Jeep, we have a very patriotic display. They are encouraging us to support our troops. Don't forget the best.
Place. Hazel Fisher Lynch Extended Daycare provides enrichment activities in a safe and fun environment while serving child care needs. They provide an atmosphere rich with experiments in art, science, cooking, nature, manners, and healthy social interaction. that we are the same age as our A's. Murphy's is home base for our club, but members from Sonora, Valley Springs, San Andreas, Altaville, Angels Camp, Murphy's, Happily Pines, Arnold, and beautiful White Pines attend. At times, our group of cars can be seen in any part of California on tour. And what's that I hear coming from this one right here? Why is the newest Space Heater CD? Yes, sir. Nothing we like better than recycling. Or recarring, as it were. In 43 years, Blue Lake Springs Homeowners Association families and guests have been enjoying the beauty, tranquility, and incredible amenities of the Snowflake Lodge area. Today's scene depicts just one of the many recreational opportunities that Blue Lake offers. You got basketball, you got your fishing. Come on, oh, Oh my goodness, you need to dredge a lake. On St. Patrick's Day, they turned it into a green lake. Well, is that true? Well, here we are, number 21, AM 1450, KBML. Covers news throughout the Northern Road with Bill Johnson, Mark Truckner, BJ Hansen, and Vanessa Turner. Oh, they feature a lot of different hosts. Like Rush Limbaugh, Sean Hannity, and Laura Ingraham. It's the Mother Lowe's Choice for news since 1949. AM 1450, KBML. Thank you. The radio voice of the Mother Lowe. Give me Rush's spot. A step into the Sierra Nevada of yesteryear when California was rapidly growing and the logging industry was at its peak. Visit the all volunteer run Sierra Nevada Logging Museum in beautiful white pines and relive our history. Visitors from around the world have come to learn about the early days of logging and enjoy the many interactive indoor and outdoor exhibits. How about you? The museum is open April through December 1st, Thursday through Sunday from noon to 4. Special tours can be arranged by reservation. Visit today and don't forget to attend our 12th annual logging jamboree at the museum on September 1st and 2nd of 2007. I know, you have every Sierra adventure you've done. I know. What great day. Number 23. Looks like the gentleman on the motorcycle is representing the Dorrington Hotel and Restaurant. Starting in 1852. The Lubro Saloon and Grill. Best hamburgers on the hill. Now, maybe. You're a little thirsty, stop in for lunch. Live music in the Lubro. It's that best price of all. Gratis. Three. Doc, stop it. You know what? You can take him out to the parade, but you can't make him behave. You, you all know where the. Uh, Warrington Hotel and Restaurant is in the little room. It's on the Elvis Pass City Flyway. I hear the deck is open now. It's nationally registered historic uh, bed and breakfast. Well, look at here. I think it's Rhonda. The 1928 Ford two-door. Tell me about it there. Jen? Yeah? Well, it's got a 32 grill, flames and paint by Jeff German, a 350 Chevy, 350 Turbo, American Racing Mag, Saddle Talks, a true American old school street ride. What do we got here, Rep? What do we got here, Travis? Well, we got a classic uh, 69 Chevy Malibu. And uh, he brought this gentleman bought it when he bought it when he left the Army, which was 37 years ago. Not bad. We love these recycled cars and these recarred cars. Well, the kayak raffle. Our next entry is the White Pines Park Committee, displaying a kayak, paddle, and life preserver, which has been donated by the Sierra, Event, Sierra Nevada Adventure Company, a $600 package. This is the perfect sitting sideboat for people of all ages. Beginning today, both Snap and the White Pines Park Committee will be selling raffle tickets for the package, so get your raffle tickets. 
The raffle will be held Friday, August 31st at SNAP, just in time for later. We got the old 1927 Model T, the same year that uh, Babe Ruth had 60 home runs. This vehicle was built. It's the WZ3 Corvette motor, 400 turbo transmission, 9 inch Ford rear ramp, deep pro origin. It's got the dual overhead cam ash tray. Yeah, stop talking to me. Stop, stop saying that to me, man. Oh, that's great. We got a 50s Willie. It's a 1950 Willie Steeps with convertible, tan body, brown fenders, and a 1966 Mustang V8 interior by Stansfield. The logo is also recently modified to add power assist to drum brakes and drum brakes and fuel injection. Recent modification by Tom Gordon. Originally modified 30 years ago. What we got here, Trampus? Number 29. Tree House Learning Center. Oh, okay. Very nice. We'd like to show our wonderful community our Sierra Adventures and how much fun we have in our mountain paradise. Hey, Dave. Hang on, man. Right on. Guys are looking good. Yeah, on. Yeah. Hey, Mommy. Yeah. <laughs> That's the way they should always go. Uh, yeah. They're up. Getting ready for their Sierra Adventures. Very nice. That's oh, more bubbles. More bubbles, I say. <laughs> Watch out for all those big tail cats and martins out there. Our own local Palo Verde Humane Society is an all-volunteer force of citizens who care about the destiny and comfort of pet animals. We promote spay and neuter education and assistance while saving hundreds of animals' lives each year by finding homes for unwanted pets. The Palo Verde Humane Society is in desperate need of volunteers and financial help. Again, the Palo Verde Humane Society is in desperate need of volunteers and financial help. Call today to see how you can help. Oh, good doggies. Look at those pretty critters. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> if you can put a calico cat on hold for us for September, we'll be by to pick it up. Thank you very much. This fire engine, number 32, is a 1925 Kenosha. Manufactured by the Kenosha Fire Engine and Truck Company in Kenosha, Wisconsin, home of the Cheesehead. The company originally produced went through trucks for use during World War I and later made a sporty automobile. The engine was originally sold to the Colfax Fire Department in Colfax, Iowa. This year's engine migrated from Perry, Iowa to California. Thanks, Steve Kovacs, for bringing this baby Arnold. Ah, bring it up as we have the Arnold Lions. Number 33, a 1980 Mercedes Benz with President Martha Gotow. And director Char Sylvester, driver owner is Larry Mulcaster. The Saw Brothers and their horse Yoshi, right in front of us here. Chase and Fisher Saw. Part to introduce Yoshi to the town of Arnold. Evan. Here we are. Mascot Sierra and the Chicory. Oh lives in the forest. She needs the forest to survive by building the nest high in the trees and she eats nuts and cones. She wants you to help her and Evans Pass Forest Watch to promote and restore healthy forests and watersheds. Hey Sierra, how are you? And keep the, keep the forest floor clean of nuts and pine cones. Thank you very much. We got number 36 coming on in. The Golden Pines RV Resort. And campground just two miles east of Calaveras Big Tree State Park. And Granny Ruth. She has a fudge and kitchen store. It's family owned secret recipes. Gourmet fudge, truffles, cocoa, ice cream, and more. Granny Ruth's Fudge.com. I won't say the first thing, but she will mail it to you. She because it's G-rated and it's supposed to be like Very good. Get a hold of Granny's. Best fudge in town. Stop by the Golden Pines RV and Campground and Resort. Even if you live around here, it is fun to be had. As we all know, more Sierra Adventures. Senor and Senorita Frog. I think we're going to wrap it up with Les Frog Azul. From the Blue Frog Restaurant located on beautiful Highway 4, and it's past City Highway. We have Senor and Senorita Frog. Costumes are by the Flemings. Costumes are very nice. And I think the Calaveras County Sheriffs on their bikes are wrapping up for us. Thank you very much, sirs. 
This concludes, we appreciate your presence. This concludes the Greater Honorables and Associates of 2007 Arnold Independence Day Parade. Thank you all for coming. The co-chairs, Bunny and Tammy, would like to say thank you to all who participated, to all who participated and all who came out to be spectators. It is because of you who volunteered. Please have a safe and sane 4th of July. Happy 4th of July, everyone.